that's whatever it is. That's a deer. No, I don't know. No, that's what it is. That's a deer. That's a deer. Who knows what that is? Come over that's here and a take a chill in the tree again. Look at this. Whatever it was, a foot slid. Just like a human would. What did it do? Make a nest right there? I don't know, dude. Look, Look at this. Right there. What's up with that? I don't know. I'm breaking. Who would walk through this? Seriously. <laughs> Not a human. Let's get out of here. Come on. Yeah, by the time that sun goes down, it's going to be dark. Gosh, I want to know where these go. If we walk a little farther, we'll break out on the river again. No, let's just go. we got to go back and get our poles. Where are they? Uh, way back there. <laughs> I'm getting out of here, man. I'm getting dark. Look, there's hair everywhere here. We don't know what the hell this is, but I'm getting out of here. I'll record in a minute. All right. We found these other tracks around the same area, but it's about 20 feet away from the other ones. Just want to show you the difference between why we know it. it's not uh, an animal like an elk or a deer, because they have four legs, and this can kind of show you how they would walk. That's obviously a deer. You can see that they've walked up in through there and stuff. But the tracks pretty, aren't huge. Pretty obvious. I mean, look, you can see right here. Look, you can see where all four legs clocked they, that snow. Yeah, they kicked that. And then it goes up in there. I'm kind of stuck between a tree right here, so I don't want to go in there. But um, just kind of show you from what we were the footage prior to this, and then to that. You know, that's what makes it so much different. Um, just thought we would record that. The steps that we found today came from that. that we found today came from that mountain over there down the road jumped a bob wire fence into private property huge five foot gaps between each step one foot in front of the other they came around this property in some different directions they came obviously came we kind of followed it they came across this river um, and then we found the steps going up into the snow right here and that's where we kind of followed it into there so we we don't really know what it is. We're just as clueless as anyone else. So if anyone uh, you know has any idea, maybe what that is, it's hard to just say it's an animal, an elk or a deer because they have four legs, and these are one huge steps in front of the other. Yeah, just doesn't... one step to the next step. Five foot gaps. Five foot gaps over trees that animals couldn't step over. Just unbelievable. We got some hair samples. Uh, we don't know what we got here, but. We are just up here doing some fishing and we we discovered these steps. Uh, and this is South Fort, Utah. So it's our first time ever, you know, we've heard of Bigfoot There's being here, right there, look. but we've never actually saw anything. The snow is the only reason that we actually noticed this stuff. There's another hair right there leading on to where whatever it was came up onto this hillside and went through those trees. Um, you know, we did check the branches for here. Though. You know, a lot of broken branches. You know, make it out to what you think it is. Uh, you know, we don't know either. You know, just out having a good time. Thought, thought we would uh, record some weird stuff. But if we see anything else while we're up here, we'll, we'll record it.